Welcome back, humble traders. Today I'll be doing a technical breakdown on Meta platforms, ticker symbol FB. This is a viewer's request. If you're new to the channel, remember to take a second to give the video a like and subscribe for more charting and price manipulations. Do note that I'm just humble chartist and I do not provide any buy or sell calls. Instead, I focus on the potential traps laid up by the market makers. Always remember, the stock market is never obvious. It's designed to fool most of people most of the time. Without further ado, let's take a look at FB or Facebook for short. Anyways, um, it seems like uh, Facebook managed to hold this 185 pretty well and we did see a bounce thereafter. We have actually went up for a few consecutive days. So that is a, a good sign. It's a potential reversal for Facebook. However, now you can see that there's, we are being trapped under this yellow line. So uh, to give a bit more context, this yellow line was drawn on the uh, Monday chart of uh, Facebook. So you can see that currently now we are being rejected off. So we actually went below it and now we are trying to clear it. So the immediate um, um, clearance or immediate um, um, price that we have to actually clear is actually this uh, particular price of about, uh, say, 217. Two, so if we do not clear this 217 price, then we may uh, potentially um, not, not, not hit any other resistance ahead. This 217 is very, very critical. And we also have to take note of what uh, fake breakouts are. For instance, this particular candle, uh, two days ago, we went about 219 and it was not very sustainable. So there's, there's, a, there's a potential uh, fake breakout. We want to see um, Facebook crossing 217 with good volume and then potentially uh, um, uh, a long green candle would be preferred as well. So after this 217, where am I actually heading for Facebook? So you can see that the, the range is pretty tight. Um, so we are looking at 224. In the event that we can cross 224, then I'm looking about 234 and 235 before we can potentially reclaim back the 248, um, um, the big four after we had a very bad earnings um, release. So all of these uh, resistance ahead for Facebook will be equally important, but I'm particularly concerned with this uh, 224 resistance because this resistance, um, it, it tells us whether Facebook will be uh, continue up its momentum. Of course, this 217 will be a, a great uh, resistance for Facebook, 217 firstly, and 224. But in the event that we can cross 224, it shows that Facebook may be potentially um, um, appearing very bullish. And the next target is about um, 10 to $11 away of 235 before we actually can uh, hit 248. But I need to uh, warn you, because this 224 is such a, a difficult resistance, a potentially a difficult resistance for Facebook to break, you need to be careful of a potential um, fake breakout here. We may perhaps go to 225 or 226. Uh, but in the event that we got blocked by 224, then uh, we will get rejected off immediately. But if there's a fake breakout, it be uh, for one, because it may come back to test this um, yellow, uh, very strong yellow line of support, perhaps around 220 or uh, 218, 219, these levels here. So what we want to see is uh, this previous resistance turn support. And thereafter, we can continue to go up further. So yeah, the previous resistance turning to support is very important because it shows that we have established an uptrend where um, higher highs are created and higher lows are also established. Higher highs and higher lows. So that is a, a good sign for a potential reversal. So yeah, just a recap, we need to clear 217 with good volume before heading to 224. This 224 resistance is um, equally uh, difficult to break through. If, but if in the event that we, we break through this 224, then if the market sentiments allow us to um, hit 235, and then we may potentially head back to the 248, which was the day high after the earning release. So yeah, if there's any changes, I'll give you guys an update. Thanks for stopping by. And don't forget to subscribe as you'll keep the uptrend on the channel intact. Leave in the comment section below your thoughts on this particular stock or if you have any other stock tea requests. Till we meet again, appreciate the manipulation.